Hi, I'm Heba. And I'm Hannah. And today we're going to be doing a director's commentary of our <clears throat> clip of The Conjuring 2. So, let's get started. So, first things that I think we should talk about is that we decided to keep the audio. Yeah. And I think we decided to keep it because... I think it gives a really good ambience to the clip. Yeah. And it helps it link. It kind of helps because it's like the natural, because it's the original audio, we didn't have to change anything. And because it's the original audio, we always had it the same. So it kept mm. the atmosphere from the, original. the original. Yeah. And also from this, you could probably see the colour correcting. We gave it a blue tint like the original. <laughs> This first whole bit is a, a pan yeah. and it's one shot. So we decided to do this because in the actual original it's one shot for around like half of the clip, yeah. I think. It's just one shot. So we reshot this a couple of times. To get it right. Yeah, so we got a really, like, got to choose which clips yeah. came out the best. Because it is one, one full clip, mm. so it was quite hard to film. We also decided to hand hold it here yeah and to make it smoother we balanced it on a book on a book so this this actually helped us like get a really smooth finish i think <laughs> so we kind of had a bit of a challenge with the lighting because yeah. we wanted to film in the dark we had a torch and shadows were being casted when we were filming and we actually found that that helped yeah, yeah but because we filmed it in the dark we couldn't always see our actress so we had to use the torch to our advantage and yeah. kind of change a couple of shots but only because of the lighting mm -hmm. i think it worked better anyway yeah same <laughs> So this is where we get another shot. Yeah. So we did actually decide to speed up a couple of clips. Yeah. I think two of them maybe. Yeah. So this is one that we decided to speed up because I think it gives us a bit more effect of fright. Yeah. Yeah. Also, we use a lot of mid shots and like where we show most, most of her of body the in the bed. Well. Yeah. <laughs> Um, we liked the really close ups in the original, so we kept we really liked that, so we kept mm -hmm. them in, and we um, played it to our advantage as well because we used the torch again to get the lightness half on her face. Yeah, which is really nice. Just as your opposites, so I think that really helped. Also, we kept the white sheets and the red pajamas because we thought this was a really awesome kind of contrast yeah. that shows danger but yeah. then also purity. Binary opposites. Uh, yeah. Um, also, when we see you see the next close up, we get closer as we go yeah. through. There's about three shots. It kind of is a sort of shot reverse shot, but not between people as such. Yeah. It's more just changing. <laughs> For the ones where we're getting closer, we actually just use the camera and handheld because yeah. when we watched the original, it was really jittery, which gave it a very like unhuman feel like presence so we really want to keep that kind of shaky camera-ness to it <coughs> the last bit there was also sped up <coughs> and we did a fade to black it's really quick yeah. but i think that gives it a really good punch kind of scares you when yeah you tell it. because if you've seen the film the film continues to show the girl waking up from yeah. that moment and screaming and i think that just the fade to black really kind of puts up punchline yeah. and you don't know what's real what's not real yeah so th this took around two mm. to three hours to film yeah yeah and editing around three hours as yeah. well i think we really wanted to show the essence of the clip but we mm. wanted to make it our own as well yeah and mm. it was a really nice shot in the middle with the torch which wasn't actually originally in it yeah it's a flare that we use yeah here so the torch and it's a really nice shot because it kind of makes the audience feel like um, they're not sure what's behind the torch, yeah. but yet we know. So, so it's, it's like kind of, shining the yeah. light on the yeah. audience. Like, also, because it's 
something every like it's very mundane yeah. it's something every day that people have these objects and i think when we came to choosing the clip we really wanted to involve that because everyday life when it's something we're so used yeah. to becomes more scary whereas if we're in a setting that's not so that we can link yeah. to we don't have that fright and because it's set in a bedroom as well because everyone mm. feels that like they're yeah. kind of safe there because we sleep there yeah so you've got to feel safe uh, the bedrooms from the original and the bedroom which we used were very similar but yeah. we had to like move things about and try to make it our own so I think we managed to do that. I think we yeah. managed to like re- I think we had a little bit of trouble with the hallway but you yeah. got around that with the book idea so. mm. I think like overall I really I'm really happy it, yeah. with it yeah, because we don't copy it every single no but I think you movement. make it better but we kept, we kept the ca- same camera yeah. shots which I think was important but we just made our own, you know, the colour correcting, um, setting, all of that stuff. So I really enjoyed this project mm-hmm. and I think moving forward, thinking about our trailer, I would, I, I really like kind of this sort of setting. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. And um, the actress as well was yeah. really good, I think. So I'm really happy with yeah. it. Yeah. Anything else to add? No, I think I really like the clip we chose. Um, it was really nice to film. We got a lot of good shots and we put our own twist on it as well with yeah. the colour correcting and some of the shots that we had trouble filming in the first one because obviously in a big camera set you've got yeah. you've got a lot of space but also we did it with yeah. one camera yeah so we weren't like somebody's there somebody's yeah. there which is a bit of struggle because we had somebody you know filming while somebody was dragging a chair yeah. like to the, Running around. the point and but, but we managed it well we fact planned we, everything how out we used the original audio helped because mm. we could shout direction to the actress and well, move the clip. chair because we yeah. always in the background which was pretty good yeah yeah thank you for watching thank you hope you enjoyed <laughs>